Hey guys, welcome back to Program Up. And today in this episode, we're gonna talk about the best laptop recommendations for AutoCAD. So some of you have actually requested for this video that what would be the recommended laptops for using AutoCAD. So today in this episode, we're gonna talk specifically about that which are the laptops that will be recommended for using AutoCAD. So before even we make a purchase of a new laptop, it's really important and essential to understand what are the system requirements that are necessary for making a purchase of a laptop for. AutoCAD specifically and even if you're trying to use any of the other Autodesk software so it will be really helpful for you as well so let's get into the system requirements and the first and foremost thing into the system requirements is a processor so a processor is really important and essential whenever you're trying to make a purchase so a CPU is really important part especially for AutoCAD because AutoCAD is a CPU intensive software not GPU intensive software that means that even if you don't have a dedicated GPU or even if you don't have a GPU that is really efficient enough that's really good so in that very case also if you have a good CPU it will help you to render the images and render the models so in that very case a very good choice of a CPU CPU is really recommended for you so I'll suggest you to go with a quad core CPU by the way if you just look at to the system requirements page on Autodesk so it suggests that we need to have a processor that is at least 2.5 to 2.9 gigahertz processor and it is recommended that if it is 3 plus gigahertz processor that will be really good for you so in that very case I will suggest you that go with a core i5 processor at least and if you are choosing into the Ryzen processor series then you should go with Ryzen 5 processor because those are really good processors for AutoCAD at this very current moment. So I would recommend you to choose a quad core processor at least into 2022 if you want a good laptop for AutoCAD. And the second most important thing is memory that is RAM. So RAM is also one of the most important component when it comes to AutoCAD. So the least amount of memory and RAM that you should have into your laptop or PC is 8 gigabytes and what is recommended is 16 gigabytes. So having a 16 gigabytes of RAM will be really good for you it will help you to render up the images it will help you to work really efficiently in AutoCAD so this is the reason why we recommend 16 gigabytes and the next thing that is important now is a GPU so most of you are confused that should we have a dedicated GPU or an integrated GPU will work really fine for AutoCAD so let me help you out with this so first and foremost thing is we need to understand what is the usage and what kind of work do we do in AutoCAD so if you're a professional or if you do mostly work in to 2d modeling so in that very case you don't need a dedicated gpu an integrated gpu into the ryzen processor or intel processor will be really good for you you can work on to that either you don't need a dedicated gpu but if you are working specifically on 3d models so in that very case you'll be requiring a dedicated gpu because that will help you to leverage the performance and help you to render the images and visuals really quick and in a really efficient manner so that is the reason we recommend a dedicated gpu for 3d modeling design and professionals who work on 3d models otherwise an uh, integrated GPU for 2d models will be really good for you so that is the overall in all recommendations and in as considering the storage in your laptop a 256 gigabytes of SSD will be really good and you don't need uh, more than that and it depends upon you what kind of usage do you have so that is the overall in all system requirements what is recommended right now and now let's get to the some of the laptop recommendations what I would recommend so we'll be having a look at to the laptops that are specifically made for 2d modeling as well as for 3d modeling so first and foremost laptop that is one of the cheapest laptops that is currently available into the market for 2d modeling so if you are specifically looking a laptop for 2d modeling in AutoCAD so that would be Acer Aspire 5 and this can be a beginners laptop and it can be a laptop for people who are just trying to learn AutoCAD so for them also this would be a really good laptop so it's Acer Aspire 5 that comes with a Ryzen 5 5500U processor that's a really good processor that that's an hexa core processor along with that it comes with AMD Radeon graphics so it comes with an integrated graphics and along with that if you consider the RAM so there's an 8 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM pre-installed into a 256 gigabytes of NVMe SSD and it is a all in all good laptop that comes at a price point of 499 so under a price point and budget price of $500 you can easily get a laptop that will be really good for AutoCAD purpose for you so if you want to purchase or check out this laptop the link will be provided down in the description below you can definitely go ahead and check out this laptop and 
other laptop that will be recommended for 2d modeling specifically will be msi prestige 14 so this laptop is also one of the really good laptops specifically for 2d modeling and 2d model creators so for them it will be really good because it comes with core i5 11 generation processor along with that it has an iris xe graphics card and 16 gigabytes of ram and 512 gigabytes of nvme ssd so it comes with a massive amount of ssd as well as ram and ram is really good onto it because it's 16 gigabytes so this will be one of the most recommended laptops if you're trying to make a purchase specifically for 2d modeling now in this laptop also you can work a little bit on 2 3d modeling but this won't be recommended that much for 3d modeling as some of the laptops with a dedicated gpu will be so if you want to check out this laptop either the link is down in the description below you can just go ahead and check out this laptop either so guys for all the laptops that we'll be checking out in this video the link will be provided down in the description below you can go ahead at any moment of time and just check the laptops if you want to make a purchase so now for the 3d modeling usage if you're working specifically on 3d models and you need a laptop with a dedicated gpu so we have some of the laptops that will be recommended laptops for you so the first laptop that i would be recommending is a lenovo ideapad 3 gaming laptop because it comes with ryzen 5 5600h processor that's an hexa core processor first of all along with that it comes with 8 gigabytes of ram 256 gigabytes of storage and the graphics card that you get into this laptop is gta 1650 so that's a really good graphics card a beginner's graphics card we can say perfectly because that's in four gigabytes of graphics card and it will work really well for you if you're working on 3d models so the laptop comes at a price point of 653 dollars and it is really good amount of budget that you can invest into a laptop for 3d modeling in autocad so if you need a laptop that is a really good performing laptop for autocad so this can be one laptop at the most budget point so next laptop that we have is once again lenovo legion 5 laptop that comes with a 15.6 inch of full hd ips display and the processor that we get over here is Ryzen 5 4600H and the graphics card that we get is GTA 1650Ti. So in this laptop you do get a processor that's an hexa-core processor along with a 4GB of dedicated GPU. Along with that the memory that you get in this laptop is 8GB and the storage that you get is 256GB of SSD and 1TB of HDD. So it's a hybrid model over here for the storage but this is a laptop that's really good for you once again but I would be recommending Lenovo IdeaPad Gaming 3 more over the Lenovo Legion 5. The reason for that is because we get a better CPU into the Lenovo IdeaPad Gaming 3 laptop. So that would be my recommendation and also the price point is a little better onto the Gaming 3 side. And coming to the next laptop we also have one more recommendation onto a budget side that is for MSI GF63 laptop. This laptop also comes with Intel processor that is a quad core i5 10 generation processor along with 16 gigabytes of RAM, 1 terabytes of SSD and GTA 1654 GB of graphics card. So this laptop is also one of the really good laptops and you can definitely use it for AutoCAD purpose and specifically if you're working on to 3D modeling so if in that very case you can actually work on to this and this laptop will be really good because it comes with 16 gigabytes of RAM and 1 terabytes of SSD. The next laptop that we have the next recommendation is Lenovo Legion 5 that comes with a 17.3 inches full HD display. Along with that you get a 5600H processor that's a Ryzen 5 hexa core processor, 16 gigabytes of RAM, 1 terabytes of NVMe SSD, and GTX 1650 once again. So, this laptop also comes at a price point of $969, and this is a really good laptop if you need a laptop with a bigger display and good display so this will be one of the laptops that i'll be recommending you because it also features a display that is 72 percent ntsc color gamut so the color accuracy on this laptop is really good you get some large space for working around with your models so this will be a really good laptop for you recommended one and the next laptop that we have in final is lenovo legion 5 once again with ryzen 7 5800h that's an octa core processor along with 16 gigabytes of ram 512 gigabytes of storage and rdx 3050 ti so the laptop over here is configured with one of the really good configurations for the usage of autocad so you can definitely go along with this laptop either this comes at a 
price point of $1091. So this laptop is not a really cheap budget friendly laptop but yet it comes with a good configuration you can definitely check out this laptop either if you need a laptop for a long time purpose for a long time use with AutoCAD so you can definitely check out this laptop either. So guys these are some of the laptops that I would be recommending you for AutoCAD and if you want to use in case MacBook so you can definitely use MacBook AutoCAD is available for MacBooks and we have already reviewed AutoCAD for MacBooks so you can definitely check out that video if you want to use AutoCAD in any of the MacBooks with the latest M1 processors or with any of the Apple Silicon processors. So we have already reviewed that and the link will be down in the description below or we will be flashing at to the right hand side top corner. So guys these are the complete recommendations for laptops for AutoCAD and if you've got any more queries any more doubts please leave that down into the comment section below and if you liked our video please hit that like button and subscribe to our channel and meet you in the next episode till then goodbye.